Should we focus on building an audience on all platforms like Instagram, Twitter, YouTube at the same time, or should we just focus on one platform at a time? So I would split this up into two parts where part one is you have the accounts everywhere. You know, whatever, whatever platform you're thinking about, have, get the accounts, right? Go get Zane the man on every account, right? Just make sure you have the accounts everywhere so nobody can, can, uh, can take it from you. Because there's so many times where then you go and say, oh crap, I don't have the account anymore. I, you know, somebody took it when you're ready to go out your quick content. As soon as a new platform comes out, try to get that account there as well. Just make that part of your daily habit and practice. Uh, step number two is, is just listen. So you don't have to be on Twitter to listen on Twitter. So if somebody is calling you out, you know, if somebody is uh, saying, hey, Xander, man, you're great on Twitter. You want to be able to respond to them. You know, you want to let yes. them know. You want to let them know you paid attention, that you heard them. It doesn't mean you're posting anything. It just means that you're paying attention and you're listening. So that, that's not hard, right? To create an account and to listen is not hard. That's not hard, right? Like, it takes almost no time. You should, you should absolutely do that. Creating content, I would pick one platform to then go and win on. Because creating content is, is a beast if you're going to do it well. And most people try to be everywhere and then suck at everything. Mm. So that's how it's split it up. Yes, you're everywhere with the account. Yes, you're everywhere in terms of listening. That'll take almost no time. Uh, but then in terms of creating content, pick one. Be great at it. Help it generate business for you and then go on and, and go on the next second one.